We were trading in um, sort of the high range of 60, 60 to 62,000 like a few weeks ago. And, um, you know, it's, it, was, it was trading at a near all time high. And whenever we're at an all time high, traders like to go long because, you know, there's no resistance overhead. And the whole market was very highly leveraged. Um, there was more um, open interest contracts in the derivative markets than we've seen any time in this year. And so when um, you're in a situation where um, the market's highly um, levered, it's very emotional. And so what happened in China was there was a power sort of outage. The Chinese power companies were uh, undergoing a safety inspection. And so it looked like um, the, the miners in China, which some estimates are between 25 and 40% of the um, mining power on the Bitcoin network is located in a, this particular area. These these miners went offline <laughs> and they went offline at a very critical point um, because the, essentially the the Bitcoin network um, balances, you know, the, the amount of hash power these miners throw at the network with the difficulty adjustment. Um, so this sort of keeps everything in check so our block times keep being processed every 10 minutes and so the difficulty just went up and within um, like something like 12 hours of that difficulty adjustment the miners uh, went offline in that part of China so we had a reduction of um, compute power thrown at the network just at a time when we needed it adjusted for this higher amount of compute that is normally thrown at it so immediately the uh, the network started to slow down the amount of uh, mining the compute was not sufficient to balance off the difficulty and so block time started to slow down and you can imagine if um, hash power starts to drop out of the network and there's a there's always been this correlation between hash power and price you know we're in this highly levered zone and um speculators sold off and it was it was a, a sell-off that was quite unprecedented for this year in that uh, nearly five billion um, contracts got liquidated hundred a lot was a million accounts were um, liquidated across across the whole ecosystem if you would include the entire um, crypto asset space it was nearly 10 billion dollars of liquidation so uh, we had a big flash crash